Welcome, welcome to my humble abode. See, I want to make videos, but university assignments and projects. So I decided, why don't I just put them together, making videos and assignments. And this is what I came up with. This is dog shit. Video quality, god damn. To be honest, I do have a pretty good camera, but I'm just too lazy to actually record it. Because I'm uploading, transferring the video, and editing the video, and all that. I guess we have, may as well do it. Huh? Everything clear? HD? You can see all my pores? Yeah! You can see all my pores! Okay. Wait, wait, I need to wear my smart glasses. Give me a sec. The project look we're going to be making a video on this embed it's called embed yeah and um this thing here right here right here can you see it can you see it yes can you see it good good this thing is like an overpowered anime protagonist yeah it has everything in it uh, lc screen potentiometer um ethernet port usb Name it is that. Yeah, you name it is a speaker or is that? Is that only that? It's just it's just so packed with all this stuff, very tiny stuff. Man, you're gonna do code into this. So the assignment has said uh, the this things that we need to make a code with a few topics in it, or else we fail. Which is um, classes, inheritance, and polymorphism. I give a very brief description of this. Topics, but um, you see, I don't have a whiteboard, so I'll be using I'll be using um, my this. What do you call this? I don't know what you call this. This and okay now, but I need something to point to it. Give me a second. What do I have? What? Um... Uh, this will do. This will, this will do. This will do. Okay. Now, first about classes. Yeah, classes. So classes. Um, pretty easy. So as the name says, it's it's a class. So basically, you you have a teacher and you have students. Yeah, you have students. Now, a teacher is basically. Like you know, teacher has control over the students, I guess. So, this what do you say? So, the wow. teacher can control the students. So, like the students are the variables inside the class, and the teacher is like the object. So, object can get anything inside the class, any variables inside the class. And you have different type of students. Yeah, and there's like the public, private, and protected. I guess private is basically either the very rich children in the class or the mentally challenged. Public is like us peons, peasants in the class, all all common people. Uh, I don't know about protected, just, just, just dumb average children, very dumb. Like they are the jocks who are mentally challenged, but they still have some use to the class. So that's the class. So you have a lot of classes and you have a teacher. And if you go shooting these children and students, that's called a school shooting, which is illegal. And I prefer you don't do it. It's your choice. Okay, next we move on to inheritance. Inheritance, the same as the name says, inheritance. So you have stick fucker. You have mother, you have father, 
then so so see father 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 very 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 brilliant will not not lord very social though very brilliant very handsome mother very social very beautiful little academically not good little academic not good but what what can we say you know very creative very creative then you have offspring a mix of dumb not social and you know you have to give a bit of spa, unique you know children need to be unique like they have to be they have to have a spark of their own and as you know everybody is just ugly so that is inherited it's basically same with programming as well so you have a parent class so you have a parent class and then you have a child class so the child the child class inherits everything from the parent class but also you can have multiple child classes for the same parent class or you can fucking have family tree do so you can basically this uh, the the yellow child inherits from green the pink child inherits from yellow you can have like a whole family tree for one that is inheritance now we come to the more annoying uh, weird topic polymorphism that is one parent class yeah, this this is one parent she has gone through a divorce a lot of case courts and then she lost and um, she had to take care of two child classes dumb child 1 and dumb child 2 yeah so these two child classes inherit from the parent class the dumb child 1 and dumb child 2 yeah now polymorphism works like this i think this is so basically if the parent class asks both children one same question so what's 1 plus 1 the parent class asks dumb child 1 answers 3 and dumb child 2 answers 10 both are wrong but for the same question they have answered differently now in coding is basically the it will be a same function and you just have different actions for the same function and you are overriding it in both classes see but with dumb children though right now they never learn you keep on telling them the exact same thing over and over again you try to be patient with them but no they never learn they never fucking learn fucking dumb children this is how basically it went for the four weeks which i did the program and i assure you sleep was not an option what follows is a brief construction montage Co- playing games Co- watching anime Co- playing games coding coding depression playing coding depression coding coding depression code code de- 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 depression code 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 So yeah, I basically coded three inputs. So the first one was the joystick controlled mouse, which is just I just control the joystick with a mouse with the cursor with the joystick and uh, it also does a right click. Yeah, mouse with the mouse like just yeah, that that's the first one. The second one is a keyboard. This is what I made in creativity and my own version. So I use uh, this potentiometer knob here. 
to I uh, split apart the inform the value given by it into 26 that how many alphabets there are right 26 24 26 i don't know uh th- that much numbers and i choose the alphabets by the knob and i uh, if i if i click the joystick and i i can i can type it out in the screen yes and the third one i got i got i got lazy yeah. so i just made a frequency sweeper you know the one when you do audio tests you get to the you hear the yeah that go that basically yeah but by any means the, the code is not optimized or efficient because uh, you know the keyboard um, keyboard input yeah i needed to do uh, for all the people who know coding or i needed to do a loop or a iteration for 26 times yes so normally any anybody sane would do it with a for loop yeah no i did it with a if else loop 24 26 times i just copy pasted it 26 times in a row so i just had like a 800 line code later that same evening Welcome back. Welcome back to the Vashiti webcam. Okay, now we will be test what is better than to test a joystick mouse than an FPS game. So we will play Counter Strike testing out our joystick. It's just so you know I'm not scamming you. Here's the embed. You see the joystick here. The mouse move is right. Oh, okay, the mouse. Ah, there. Yes. Yeah. So we are going to be playing death match. Let's see. Okay, controlling is good. Good, good sensitivity. Good sensitivity. That's... Our goal is to get one kill. <laughs> No. No, oh, oh, no, 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 how much did I get? 24 re- No, come on, he's so close, 66, no No, oh no, why did you take a kill man? Oh. Yes! Oh no, he took the kill. No, man. Don't hit kids. Oh! Oh! Yes! Let's go. Let's go. Uh, one kill is all we need, boys. One kill is all we need. Uh okay, now for the second test is the keyboard. So, not bad yet. Just let's go not bad. Let's type something. There you go, a literary masterpiece. Just a masterpiece. Mwah, mwah. Wonderful. Now, as the last thing is the. frequency sweeper as nothing else we can do but this Thank you.